Okay, so so far I think we're almost an hour in. And I gotta say, my impression so far is the game is really good. It's just like the last game, only it's got a different setting. It's uh, a little bit funnier in my opinion. There's a little bit more going on. GLaDOS is a lot more sarcastic. A lot more of a, excuse my language, a cunt. She does know how to clean up the place, I will give her that. This next test involves the Aperture Science Aerial Faceplate. It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. Well, look at this, the she's cleaning the place up. They could not. Good luck. Clean up and putting clean tiles in here? That's great. Whoa! What the f What the heck was that? Oh, I guess it's a launching plate of some sort. Don't know what the point of it is, though, yet. Oh, look at this. Alright, I can already tell what I'm supposed to do with that. Whoa! Alright, let's see here. Oh, no, no. Alright, I gotta time this right. That's a go! Crap. I'll get it. Just give me some time. Crap. Alright. Let's do it. Got it. Ah, told you I'd get it. Woo! Got it. Here's an interesting fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too expensive to pump this far down. Huh. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room. Freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. That, that was kind of interesting, actually. In a demented, murderous, intense sort of way. Let's see what the next test is. Oh. Advanced aerial faceplates. Didn't we just well, do that? Have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. Well, life sucks for you. And now I'm moving on. Good stuff, good stuff. Things falling out of the sky. Liking this so far. Advanced aerial faith plates. Oh, whoa. Whoa. That was close. But on the bright side, I think I do know how to get through this part now. So, just go back there. If I can... Alright, just gotta aim these now. Get ready to shoot a blue portal onto that one thing over there. Got it! Good stuff. Very nice. Zoom. Alright, so there's a button there. Oh, sorry. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. So sometimes there's still trash in them, standing around, smelling and being useless. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. Oh look, there are turrets being flung around here, that's just great. Oh, is there anything I can use in here? It doesn't look like it. Here comes our cube! Oh no! Ah. Alright, is there anything I can use to get back up here? Yes, there is. Alright. 
Ah, crap. I just realized. Gotta put a portal there first of all so I can get that cube there. Alright. Good luck, little friend. Oh, good. It's still there. Good stuff. Remember before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? This is going to be directed towards me. a metaphor. I was actually talking about you. See? And I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head. No, I kind of saw you it at the beginning. You apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. That was incredibly weak. I'm sorry. And here comes a sneeze. Mm -hmm. I think I stopped it. I think we're good. We're fine. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? I'm sorry. I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. That didn't startle me in the least. <laughs> Alright, more lasers. These look a little bit higher up, though. Huh? No, no, still able to jump over them. Oh, did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the test? I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. <laughs> Very funny, tried to drop it on my head. Oh, look at this! It's, the, it's my old friend, the companion cube. How nice. Oh, no. I fizzled that one too. You jackass! Oh well, we have warehouses full of the things. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. Are these things just gonna fizzle out before I can even grab them from now on? Let's test that. Alright, so far so good. But I really don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. Okay, I'm confused. Huh. Yeah, just suspected. I can't put a portal there. I think we're getting to the point in the game where the puzzles are starting to get a little harder. Of course, watch me say that and then the friggin' solution will pop into my head that's incredibly simple. Up, oh, see? What'd I tell you? Friggin' simplest puzzle solution. Alright, can I not take the cube with me? I guess not, but then how was I supposed to... Ah, wait a sec. There we go. Alright, that's solved the problem. Whoosh! There we go. Of course, now how am I supposed to get that cube there? I guess I could just go back down there and... Up. Going down. And there it goes. Sweet. Up, oh, dodge the laser. Now put the portal there. Jump. Very good. Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill and its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. <laughs> Don't take anything with you. You know, now that she said that, I'm gonna go back and explicitly grab something to take back with.